Let's make some interlocking gears with this image from the internet. Bring in a circle, 32 vertices. Rotate X90 and go into vertex selection and center it over the first gear and scale it till you get the size that you like. E and S come into the middle. Control I to flip your selection. Press two for edge selection and then press select. Check your deselect. Make sure you got ones here. E and S and come on out to about the distance you want. Switch from median point to individual origins and as the S and scale just a little bit. A to select it all. E and extrude out a little ways like this. Select one of these faces, choose select, select similar perimeter to get them all, and individual origins S again to scale them in a little bit. Switch back to median point in three for face selection, shift alt to click there, and the back faces. Press I to inset, bring it in a little ways, E and SY, scale on the Y and push to push it in a little bit like this. Come on out, back to object mode, go from the modifiers, choose bevel, switch it to two, angle, arc, shade smooth, and then add another modifier, weighted normal, and then down here, choose auto smooth. Let's have a look at that. You can uh, scale this uh, in the Y if you want, to make it bigger like that. That's no problem. Okay, let's look again from the front. We're going to do another shift A mesh circle. If you started with 32 for the first one, this one do 48, one and a half times. Bring it around. Rotate X 90. Scale it to the approximate size of the gear here. E and S come on into the center. Control I to invert two for edge selection. Select check or deselect again with ones. E and S bring it out to the distance you want. Individual origins S to scale them in a little bit. A to select it all. E to give it some thickness. In face selection, select one of those spaces. Select similar perimeter. Now if that happens, try going around and doing a few of them. Select similar perimeter. And if it doesn't work, you may be stuck going all around here. All right, close enough. Individual origins, S to scale. Shift Alt and click the front faces and the back faces. Go into median point. I'd inset. E and SY push. With that done, shift alt to click that one, control L, modifiers, shade smooth that, and with that one selected, auto smooth. Select both of them, slash key one, focus on them, and then just position this one a little bit better. Now, polys have probably flipped. A to select everything, go into edit mode, alt and recalculate outside, and bring back to there. We have two interlocking gears. Let's check this one for the thickness, look from the side, select it, you can center it up, scale that in the Y if you want a nice thick one. Okay, you can also come in here and shift alt and click all those faces. I'd inset again, E and SY, and this time pull out to get a different effect on this gear right here. Okay, and if you prefer them to be the same width, you can just scale that back in. And you've got two interlocking gears.